this uh, this year it was my third year to be involved in the Samaritan's Purse shoeboxes, and it's probably my favorite year this year. We changed it up a little bit to where we had our program to be a smaller group instead of a bigger group distributing the boxes. And I really enjoyed the one-on-one -on -one time with parents. This year they um, came and we had an area where the parents could sit and the children were watching a film uh, that uh, kept them occupied. And just to be able to talk, talk with the parents and get to know them was probably my favorite part of this year. Um, I think it's something that has become a tradition here now that our team has done and distributing to the community here in Dobrinja, which has been amazing because people remember it and they come back year after year and they find us and they come looking for us. Is there going to be shoeboxes this year? When do you distribute packages? And, and it's really great because people then know us. It's really been a great way for us to make contact with people in community, build a good relationship in the community. But this year we especially wanted to communicate even better to them the meaning of these packages. It's not just to give them toys and candy, but we want to communicate something more about the gospel. And this year we try to emphasize that in every package they actually find something that they can't see, and that's love. And where did that love come from? Why are people sending these shoeboxes to them in the first place? Yes, it makes the kids happy and that's really great, but there's something more in there that each package they'll find, they open that up, and that's just examples of love. That every toy, every piece of candy, or even a, a gloves for their hands or a hat for their head is an example of God's love to them. That somebody in a faraway country cares about them and loves them enough to send a box. And for me, it's always just an amazing privilege to be involved in that side of the Shemaritan's Purse project, that I can be the one to be there to give a box to a kid and to be able to share that love with them and say, this is from God for you. This is his love to you, an example of it. And to share that with the parents, I think it means a lot to them that we do this for their children and that we make this opportunity uh, for their kids to receive something that they don't, didn't have to earn, they didn't have to do anything for. It's been given freely to them, and that's how we want them to view God's love.